We're here today at the Shepherd and Project with Lisa McKenzie and Adam Ruby. And we've had the most magnificent day finding out how they do their collective impact approach and the great successes that they're having in this area. If you could quickly just summarise for us, Lisa, what do you think are the three most critical things that we need to do to make it work? For us, I can't speak for every community, but for our community, it's been around starting with deep listening responding to that, creating connections, it's those connections that everyone needs to thrive and trying to create those for every kid in our community. The storytelling that comes around that, so understanding the narrative around people's lives and what they need to succeed and how we can put in place the same things we want for all of our kids, for every kid in ship. And I guess in a lot of ways to do that, we've had to carve out a space and really hold the line. So uh, it seems it's simple in a way, but it's really also really hard. And so uh, Adam has been instrumental in helping to do that as our chair of our board. And uh, we have a lot of great people around us, which I think has made all the difference. Fantastic. So Adam, when things get difficult, what is it that you need to do to hold that line and to influence and to assist Lisa in a CEO role to continue to move forward? Uh, so the things that I think are important in terms of helping the executive or the team get on with uh, get on with what it is that they're doing from from a board's point of view, uh, I, I think it's about playing the role that uh, both from a governance point of view certainly, but also from a community member uh, point of view. These organisations wouldn't exist if everything was going okay. You've got to recognise that you know it is a bit of a disruption type process. That you taking um, and that it is gonna you know, there is going to be a bit of conflict coming away because if, if it wasn't it probably wouldn't be a problem um, so I think it's about just sort of recognizing that and continuing to assert um, the communities call for an expectation of a plan for their own region rather than being part of a bunch of plans of different organizations who don't necessarily have our location at the centre of their